Nelson Chamisa, the former leader of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, has dismissed calls for Zimbabweans living in South Africa to return home and participate in Zimbabwe's elections, labeling the notion as futile and a return to hell. This sharp response comes in direct rebuttal to comments made by South African opposition activist Julius Malima, who earlier this week urged Zimbabweans living in South Africa to engage in the political process back home. Malima had argued that Zimbabweans should not be passive spectators in their country's political landscape, however, Chamisa, in an interview countered Malima's call, painting a bleak picture of Zimbabwe's political reality. Just the past year we have had a number of Zimbabweans leaving the country seeking better and greener pastures, better opportunities, Chamisa stated, highlighting the exodus of Zimbabweans seeking a better life abroad due to the country's economic woes. To invite people back into hell or to invite back into this very difficult situation, I think it is disingenuous. We have to correct the settings. Zimbabweans have a role to play in elections, but the elections are actually not proper elections, he added, casting doubt on the legitimacy of Zimbabwe's elections, Chamisa went on to detail his concerns about the electoral process, citing past irregularities. So even if Zimbabweans were to come, Look at what happened in the past elections, people were in the queues, the ballot papers were not there. The Zimbabwe Electoral Commission could not produce ballot papers, and it turned out that Mr. Umningagwa's friend Wicknell Shavale was actually printing the ballot papers and playing the sabotage. The election was just a sham. So, to talk of elections and Zimbabweans coming to those elections and participating is a bit of a challenge. The opposition leader's comments highlight a key issue facing the Zimbabwean diaspora, the lack of voting rights. 